Hi, it's Cora, and I want to do a simple shoulder stretch here. So, I'm going to ask you to have a yoga belt, or you can also use something that's long, like a bathrobe belt. Also. I don't really care if you're seated in Vajrasana or Sukhasana or if you're seated in a chair or even standing up. But whatever you choose, just figure out how much of belt you need for you to be able to take, keep your arms straight and go up and over without bending your arms. So bring the belt to the front and inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Two more. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Last one. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale and exhale down. Inhale up to just above your head and just go right behind and then just pull. You're sort of that spot right there. You might even want to turn your head and pull and pull and then come back to center. Then I'm going to mirror you. So take your left arm up and take your right arm behind. Then taking it up Again, right arm up, left arm behind. Once again, left arm up, right arm behind, and then right arm up, left arm behind. And then coming back to center, take the belt and just stretch side, pull the belt, and to side, pull the belt. Now, take the belt and put it between your thumbs and fingers like so. Then wrap your hand around until you have a nice hold. And it's about shoulder width apart. Shoulder width apart would be about that you could take your elbows to your side. So, <clears throat> holding onto the belt, take it behind your head, then pull as you begin to press up. Again, bring it down, pull the belt. As you begin to press it up and your arms might shake, all the way up. One more time. Bring it behind, pull, pull and press, pull and press. All the way up. Don't your shoulders feel nice now? So, now I'm going to do the neck. So, again, I will be mirroring you. Take your ear, your right ear, toward the right shoulder. And just feel how that feels in that stretch. Then come up to center. Take your left ear and go toward your left shoulder. Notice if the opposite shoulder wants to rise up, just to send it down. And then come on up to center. Then take your right ear toward the right shoulder. Take your right hand, place it on your head, and then just gently press your head toward the right as you stretch your left arm out. And then come up, and again, taking your other ear, the left ear toward the left shoulder. Taking the left hand, just gently press and reach the right arm and reach as you take your head over. And then release. Now, taking your chin, your head toward your right armpit. Bring your chin toward your right armpit. Bring the head toward the armpit. You might feel something in the back here of the neck. 
tilt it, you'll feel the stretch. <clears throat> then come back up to center, and then take your chin to the opposite shoulder again. Now to the left, I'm sorry, left, <laughs> left armpit. Bring the chin down, and just bring your head toward the armpit. Then, taking your right ear again now, taking it towards your right shoulder. This time, bring the head down, but as you press your head down, imagine that the chin could go up as you press down. And you might feel some opening in the back. And then the other side, taking your left ear to the left shoulder and bringing the left ear down and then turning the head up as you press down and look up. And then back to center. You can then take your thumbs, place them underneath your chin and just feel the jaw and just trace the jaw. Just do that again. Take your own thumbs, go underneath the chin. You'll just feel that the chin bone is like right here. And then just press in. You're just releasing the jaw in the back. Just one more time. And then just opening the jaw. This will all just help feel like you have opening down the throat and the neck and go to the shoulders. So. Short shoulder and neck opening for you.